do you give yourself thinking time? Time that is purposely set aside to reflect on your passions, your purpose, your direction in life, uh, whether or not you feel like you are living the kind of life that you wish to live. I recommend that you set aside that time. So whether it's you know on a weekend, you set that aside. For me, it's on Saturdays. I don't schedule anything. No work appointments, no social appointments. My Saturdays are completely blank. And so that allows me really the whole day for thinking time if I wanted to. And usually it's doing a, 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 an extra long dog walk on a Saturday and that. And, and that's another point about thinking time is it's really helpful to have it where you feel at peace in an environment that is serene rather than rushed and uh, where you feel stressed. Now, it's not necessarily an environment that's totally quiet because some people think well in a, in a noisy cafe, you know. So find an environment where it's helpful for you to uh, reflect, to journal maybe. And that's another part of thinking time is to definitely build some, some journaling or writing into it or even just thinking, thinking, and then speaking uh, into a voice memo app to record your thoughts or, or to, you know, to write a few notes so that you can uh, look back at the notes later and implement something from the thinking time. Make some changes to your, to your priorities, to your schedule, uh, to your projects. So that's my encouragement to you in this video, is to build in your thinking time. Don't just assume that it's going to happen normally. And if you don't build in thinking time, you'll just keep on living life, doing in the same direction, uh, maybe not in your most uh, purposeful direction. And, and we change, our purpose changes as we change over the years. Even, even within a few months, your purpose or passion may change. The thinking time, the reflection time, is so helpful to keep you connected to your essence, to the truest part of who you are. So I welcome you to comment below this video if you do have thinking time and how do you do it. Uh, for me, it's again c coming on a dog walk. In fact, I have, I have a dog walk every day. You know, it's not as long as the Saturday one, but every day I have some thinking time. Saturdays are, are special for, for longer, longer time. Um, uh, I have a client who t told me that her thinking time is riding a bike. She, rides a, she goes on a long bike ride and she kind of talks to herself as she rides the bike, right? Other people might go to the water, a lake or an ocean, um, just even sitting by the water, watching the waves roll in or watching, watching the, the peacefulness of the lake is helpful for reflection and thinking. And uh, you might want to bring some questions with you for thinking time. So a question that is useful might be, um, am I living my purpose? Or what is my heart calling to now? So anyway, I'm going to keep this video short and uh, just encourage you to have some thinking time.